Hey Turtle Squadron, Commander Yoda here, and welcome back to another video. Um, today I will be going over how to use my old blender rig, because I made a new one, and, um, yeah, I made a new one, and I thought I would be nice and give away my old one. So, and, so here, and how to use it, of course. So, here's how it is. So, to change your skin, you click on, you right click, the object, the character itself, go under the textures panel. Okay, yeah, yeah, so, so, there. So you have to left click on the thing called material point zero zero one, which is the skin, and you go textures, and then, okay, then you go into image, and then you press this X button, you press open, and then you go look for it. Then you go select your skin, and it'll change it. Um, and, okay, so here's how, here's some functions that you can do. You can open and close the mouth by doing that. Um, see when you open it, the mouth opens, and it has the little jaw drop. I like that. And when it's open, you can make the mouth, um, make it skinny, wide, and you can also close open and close the teeth. Okay, so that's it for the mouth. And then with the eyes, you can open and close them. Um, you can make them go up, down, as well as left and right. And with the eyebrows, you can move them up and down. And you can rotate them. And then for the right hand, there's a grip where it is the where you can grab things. And then I'll close that. Then there's the open. It, it looks kind of weird with. It looks like it's this thumb. The thumb is glitchy, but it's not. So that's open. And then there's right hand point, where you know it's pointing. And to make the finger a little bit longer, you can do the grip. And it gives it a little effect like here. Yeah, so. Okay, so that's for the um, right hand. It's the exact same with the left hand. You can like, oh, it's the exact same. Okay, so now to move the armature, you press, you select this little, you select this top of the bone, and you press X ray. So now you can see him, you can see the X ray, the armature through the body. So now if you press pose mode, you can you know, position it, and how I have it s set up is that when you rotate it, it has a smooth bend, like it has a nice smooth bend, and yeah, and then that's the same with both arms and the body, see, smooth bend, oops, okay, and that's also with the knees, it looks like it's um, glitching, but it's not. See, what I've noticed is that's weird about Blender is that it sometimes lo it looks like it's glitching, but it's not. Like, look at the nose; it looks like it's glitching, but it's it really isn't. And then when you rotate the head, and then when you rotate the upper body, it rotates the arms. And if you do that, it rotates the head as well. And to move the whole thing, you press, you select all of them, and you can move them. And to use the timeline with it, you just open up the timeline. I'll start it. Oops, zero. Okay. And then you press this little button, and then wherever you rotate it, like I'll put this, and rotate it like that. So now the starting position is there and to do the to make it so the um, mouth and stuff transitions through as the timeline to like maybe have at frame 50 it he blinks so you go to f frame 50 then you isolate then you select this you press uh, um well to have him blink I always go to so I so I would go to 48, go down to eyes, open, close, 
go over this value bar, press I to make it open, go over to, close them, and then go over to again and open them. So now if I go to the beginning of my animation, as it plays through, you can see, he blinks. So that is how to use my blender rig. Um, so w once again, the download link is in the description. Now you know how to change his skin, how to operate um, his face functions and his hands, how to move his body. So I thank you guys for watching, and I will s may I will probably do a Blender tutorial series on how to make this guy because if you were never sure how I made him. I would go through the process. I wouldn't do the new, how I made the new one, because I don't want people to have the exact same rig as me. Because, I mean, I worked hard for it. And, um, yeah, but it'll be like the boxy mouth, not very good fingers, and stuff. So, um, yeah, so thank you. I'll see you next time. Hope you guys have a great day. Bye!